What's up everybody, it's Rick, and uh, welcome to Plate Up, a game that I've played quite a bit with the Stumped Group, uh, and I've found myself actually playing quite a bit in my spare time too, and I figured why not record some with y'all, because it seems like quite a bit of you guys like watching our multiplayer stuff on Stumped, so uh, I'm going to try this solo and see how well I can do. I'm noticing that there's a reload save. I didn't know that you can save mid-run, but that's really good to know. And this is going to be a lot different because I'm used to having three other chefs in the kitchen with me, but we're going to go at it alone. And let's see what I have unlocked now. Bye-bye, kitty cats. Uh, let's see. I got the city. I got the city. I got the country. I got pies and I got steaks. Over here, what do we got that we can bring with us? A tra okay, a couple dumb waiters, which is pretty convenient. And an ordering terminal. Those will all be really nice, actually. But you know what? I think... Considering I'm going to be going this alone, I'll take an ordering terminal and I'll take a dumbwaiter. We'll have to pick up another dumbwaiter on our way, figure that out. But uh, what is the layout that we want in the kitchen? Well, I feel like this city layout, pretty simple. Let's do it. And I'm going to go for pies. Let's make some pies. Ready up? And let's go for it. Day one. So, I know that there's this new franchise system that's been introduced in the new update once we get past day 15. So, that's going to be the goal, all right? Need flour? I know how to make pies. And let's open up. I got my dumb waiter. Okay, so I'm going to put the dumb waiter in this dish area in anticipation of us eventually getting another dumb waiter. Okay, we got the ordering terminal. I suppose I put this out here for customers coming in, right? So, here you go, Custies. I'll put the terminal there for you guys. You guys can order as you see fit. And then, um, you know what? I'm going to start by putting these tables against the walls. It is kind of far away. I realize that. You guys can be like, Rick, why are you putting them as far away as possible? Well, I'm hoping that we can get some more tables here soon and really fill this lobby up. And it is actually pretty small. I would love to get a bigger uh, restaurant eventually. But you know what? Uh, with time. With time. Okay, let's just arrange this how I want it. I'm going to put the trash can in here. I'm going to move the sink. This is going to be our dish room. There we go. Uh, as far as cooking goes, I'm going to move all the cooking up here because you can sort of see what's going on. And uh, I guess, you know what? This will work. This will work. Th this this will be fine. Plates? Eh, you know what? Plates will go right there. Okay. Let's, let's try that out. We can always change the layout if we need to. Okay, so there's only one thing that we cook, and that's pies. We gotta knead this twice in order to make pie dough. And this guy's... let's see. It says that there is the ordering terminal. I thought that they would place their own orders, but I guess they don't. Get that cooking. Do I place their order? Oh, you know what? I... do I take... oh god. I'm already gonna start lighting things on fire here. Well, I know what he's gonna want. He's gonna want a pie. Watch this. Hey, bud. Take your order. Put that there. Hey. Pie! There you go. So how the hell does the ordering terminal work? Do I take the order? I thought that they placed it. Oh, jeez. Okay. Already off to a great start here. I thought that they placed their own orders, but here we are. Okay, get that cooking. We'll grab this plate real quick. Please don't start the fire. This person's also going to want a pie. I can tell you right now. Hey, bud. What could I possibly get you? A pie? Who would have thought? Okay, and you're just making a terrible mess already. Bad customer. Okay, I'm just gonna put that there. Go wash a plate. Okay, I'm gonna have to figure out how this ordering terminal works next time. I really thought that the ordering terminal, they place their order, but maybe I take their order from the terminal. Maybe that's how it's supposed to work. I think I only get two customers today anyway. But just in case we get one other cut. Oh, nope, we're gonna get one more. We're gonna get two more. Oh, it's the evening rush. Okay. Well, I'll make two pies then, in anticipation. Okay, guys, here I come. I got a pie for you. And I got a pie for you. There you go, guys. How do you work? What is your secret? All right, let's just clean this up real quick. I don't need to. There we go. It'll clean itself. Congratulations. I own I own 20 coins? $20? Got a mop. I probably can't buy anything. Actually, I can buy a table. Um, 
I can buy a dining table. And you know what? If I've learned nothing else from this game, it's that I should probably buy a dining table. Uh, eventually, we're going to want as many dining tables as possible. I didn't want to do that. I wanted to do that. A knife and a gas limiter. Okay, well, I can't actually... Knife doubles my chopping speed, which I think is also my uh, kneading speed, too. Ooh, you know what? I feel like we will get an option for more tables, but increasing my chopping speed, that sounds like it's going to be pretty dang handy. So you know what? I'm going to put that there. And you, ordering terminal, how do you work? What's your deal? I wish that it would give me the, the stuff for the ordering terminal again. Like, tell me how it works. Internet, tell me how it works. Um, you know what? I'm gonna gr Maybe I used the order- oh, Wait, I, I, I'm, I'm confused by this item. I'm gonna put you in the kitchen. Okay? See if I can use you. Let's go. Wait. That doesn't work for kneading? Okay, that was a useless item. I have no idea how this ordering terminal is supposed to work. How do you work? Oh, he wants a pie. Okay, I guess that did work. I guess I could just take their order from here. Which I... Oh, wow, I need a plate. Like, obviously, I know he's going to want a pie. It's the only thing I serve. And then you... Unceremoniously make a mess. Thank you. Thank you! Okay, and this jabroni certainly is going to want a pie. Okay, so he wants to order. I go to the ordering terminal. There you go. He wants the pie. I give him the pie. Here you go, buddy. And I'll pick up this other plate while I'm out here. Here's a pie for you. I'm gonna grab this. I'm gonna wash the plate. I need to pick up the mess out there. All the things that I need to do. And I'll just prepare a couple other things before I go out there and clean this mess. What are you gonna want? Let me guess. Pie? Pie coming up. Here you go, my friend. This is pie for you. There we go. Clean up this mess now. Oh my goodness. Could you imagine if people were this messy? Like, what would become of the world? Okay, uh, expect a group four. Congratulations. We only made $15 that day. That's that day. That ain't nothing. I want a frozen prep station. That'd be good. Hey, Danger Hub, don't need you. Uh, can't buy a dining table. I literally can buy nothing. You need to be able to make more money in a day. I only made $15 that day. That ain't nothing. That's a garbage day. Okay, here we go again. Because I can literally buy nothing. This game, obviously... It's not even an early access. This is just like a demo that keeps getting updated, and I gotta give props to the developer who keeps working on this game for the very few people who have access to it, and I'm very grateful for that, that I do have access to it. Um, but uh, I would love to see a little bit of rebalancing, because when you only make $15 in a day, and then you get all these options to buy things, what's the point if you can't afford any of it? Give me the plate. And take your order. Take your order. And then I'll, I'll get your order in just a minute, bud. Let me make your pie, okay? I can read your mind. You're gonna order a steak pie. There we go. Take your order. There you go. Boom. Boom. Okay, we got people lining up now. I gotta clear this table. There you go. Plate. Move! Plate. Clean the mess. I need to get a little robot to help me clean these messes. Alright, put you there. Start making a couple pies. I gotta do the dishes. I gotta do the dishes! Okay, there's one pie. Um, oh god, I got nowhere to... 
Make another pie. Okay. It's right, we're gonna do this. We just got two tables to serve, no big deal. Got it, got it, got it. Okay, put you in. What, hey, 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 in the oven. Trying to give me a hard time. Okay, open, plate you. Okay, I got, I got the goods, here we go. Hello, everybody. Take your order, there you go, you want a pie. Coming up, there you go, this other table. They want some stuff, they're gonna get it. Gonna make you two pies, don't you worry. Don't worry, guys, it's coming. I would be very upset if I was waiting this long for someone to take my order. I get it, guys. It takes forever to make this dough. I know, I see that little thing shaking. Hold on. There you go. And pie number two. There you go. Okay, what a day. What a day. I was complaining about how I didn't make any money before, but made lots of money that time. I don't even need to do this stuff. The plates wash themselves. Just do a little dance. Celebration dance. All right. We now got one star. And the crowd goes wild. Uh, upgrade my restaurant. Okay, so this is the confusing part of the game. Not this part where we can select something. Vegetable pies or morning rush. Uh, more customers at the start of each day. You know what? Whew. I feel like I'm going to do that instead of adding an item. I'm just I'm going to do it. Morning rush, whatever. Um, this is the confusing part. Okay, so upgrading your restaurant. You get to do this every three days. Some of the stuff is free. Like I can put in the blue carpet. Ooh la la. I'd rather put in this tile. There we go. I'm going to put this blue carpet outside for right now. What's confusing is upgrading. So you can see there's these little diamonds. So I think that means negative one homie plus one fancy and then there's plus one fancy negative two food and i think that that's fast food so if it's negative two fast food i and i'm interpreting this based off what i'm seeing there's a lot of people commenting on our playthroughs on stumped i have no idea where they're getting this information because i cannot find any information on the internet about these but what i think this means is that it makes your uh place fancy it makes it tidy and it is negative too which means that people are going to eat their food longer i think the burger means that they will eat it faster it's a fast food place and then uh so anyhow there's one other thing and it's a tie um but I, I i don't know what all of these things mean well i guess there's that's it it's just the tie i think it's just diamond burger tie those are the three things Anyhow, we're going to try to make our place, uh, I don't know, fancy. we got a lot of fancy items. Uh, this is more... Should we make it red in here? Ooh, that's a little gauche. No, thank you. Get rid of the red, all right? You're out of here. And in the back, let's do some of the checker. Yeah, I like that. That's cool. Uh, tidy plant. That costs 60 That's too expensive. I have a feeling a lot of this stuff's going to be too expensive. What do we got here? Uh, a vase. Ooh, we can't even afford a vase. A rug is 60, too expensive. 60, too expensive. We could buy a candelabra. That's going to be one fancy for two tiles. You know what? I'll buy the candelabra. Sure. Okay, candelabra. And it's good for two tables. So I think that that means that it has a range of two. So let's see. If I do like this and then I move this table here... I think it will affect both of these tables. I think. How can I see? Oh, there it is. There, there's one diamond. One diamond. And I believe if it gets to three diamonds, then these tables will get an upgrade. All right, so we got to make it fancy, y'all. Let's go. Okay, we're going to get our morning rush, so I'm going to start to prep some stuff fast. Yep, here. Oh, it is really rushing, isn't it? So I got this ordering terminal, but because I know what they're going to want at this point, it's pointless. If I get another item that needs to cook, then, you know, there may be a point to taking their order back here. But at the moment, not really a point to it. So I'm going to take their orders up front because I know what they want. There you go. You, sir, come on in. Get yourself some food. I'm going to go just pick up this plate real quick. That guy's stuck on a door. 
because everyone in this world is stupid, which may explain why they just make messes like this. Because they're just a bunch of stupid, stupid people. Unlike the real world, which is just full of just smart, sophisticated individuals. Can't throw a rock without hitting some super smart, sophisticated person who's completely rational. Okay, other pie, boom. Um, take that one out, put that one in, put this in the thing. Take that out of the thing. Okay, I got both my pies. I'm coming, I'm coming. What do you want? Boom, you got it. What do you want? Hey there, there's a pie. Got your plate. Do some dishes. All right, I think we're crushing it. Though we did get a morning rush, it seems like the evening rush. Oh, okay, I guess there's a couple people coming. It seems like there wasn't really an evening rush. Kind of really slow down there, which is okay. I guess we could probably get one other customer. We'll see. Actually, these things cook too fast. I was going to go try to grab a plate, but these things just cook too fast. There you go. And put that there. Hey, one more customer. All right. They're fighting over the doors. These dum-dums cannot figure out how to make the doors work. But I think we've all experienced that, you know? Like when you're trying to get out of an elevator. People are trying to get in, but they won't let you out. What's wrong with people? There's an order to things, okay? It goes, people get out of the elevator, then you get on. And if you're one of those people who tries to rush onto an elevator before people get off it, guess what? You're rude. People are upset with you. I think that we're done here. Yeah, we are. Hey, we made $60 reduce that day. Pretty good stuff. Let's go see what we have available. Uh, fancy tablecloth. Okay, so that's gonna be another diamond. Uh, I think it's only good for one table. No, I think that that is a table. I think this is a new table. Table, fancy cloth. So it's going to have built-in plus one fancy. Well, I just built- I just bought this. I did not mean to do this. Oh, great. Okay, well, we're not buying anything fancy today. Alright? Uh, this goes here. I did not mean to buy that. We can't afford anything else, so kind of pointless looking at what we have available. I suppose I could just start to prep a bunch of pies. Can I put a whole pie in here? Let's find out. No, I can't. I could put pie dough, though. I guess I could prep the pie dough and have it ready. I hope. Because it takes so long to make pie dough. It is upsetting how long it takes. All right, here I come, folks. And it's rainy, which I think it means that it's going to be messier. There you go. All right, y'all coming in. Give me some pie, get some pie, get some pie. Oh, we can name our restaurant too. And I gotta name our restaurant after today. What are we gonna call our restaurant? Uh, there we go. Hi, number two coming up. Okay, there's a little little efficiency things that I could probably get a little bit better at. Like, uh, plating the stuff and whatnot. But we'll get there. Oh. I need to get a sink that's capable of holding more dishes. Automating this restaurant is going to be real important for us since, uh, I'm working alone. I gotta find all the things I'll automate. The automated mixer, the automatic dishwasher, all of these things. Okay. Oh god, these people are waiting. They just need this cleaned up. There we go. Uh, oh god, I need a place to put this. Um, dumb waiter. There we go. And come on in, guys. Okay. There we go. I gotta put this somewhere. Okay. Making some pie, making some pie. Oh jeez. Okay, here we go. There's your pie. Eat it. Okay, we just gotta keep patient, and we'll be able to get this, okay? Put it back down. Okay, pie number two coming up. Oh god, this person really wants to eat. I gotta go get this off the table, and then you can come in. Please don't burn. Okay, good. Um, you go there. Go there. Go there. Go there. Uh... There you go. And for you. The place is a mess. 
but it's okay. We only got one other person to serve. How many of you guys thought I was gonna fail? How dare you? Shame on you. I'm never gonna fail. We're getting a franchise. Okay, and I'm not gonna bother cleaning because it'll all be clean in the morning. There we go. Um, what I am gonna try to do is try to knock out a dough. I'm not gonna be able to. Buying this prep station. Oh, I can't put a dough in there. Ooh, one dough. I got one extra dough. Okay. Uh, so, we made $40. Can I buy anything with 40 bucks? Uh, counter. I don't really need a counter. I mean, uh, power sink. Oh, I wish I could buy you. Um, another power sink. Wow, okay. Another dumb waiter. I can't afford many of these things, though. Uh, another counter. Uh, another table would be good. I can afford the table. I'd kind of be foolish not to buy it. I'll put that table there. Turn that one off. And I think that that's pretty... Wait, yep, that's pretty much all I can do right now. But I talked about naming this place. And I'm going to name this place uh, the Pie of Sauron. There we go. Welcome to the Pie of Sauron. And um, I guess get the day started. Okay, I'm going to start out by making dough, okay? Even if it means that a couple people have to wait just a little bit, I'm going to make some doughs. Prep them up. We got, oh, we got the extra table now. There we go. Don't even care that they're waiting. I'm going to prep these. Slow and steady. We got an extra table. Okay. Oh, come on. There we go. Okay. Oh, open. There. Okay. Okay. People are waiting. I hope that this pays off. Okay. Got this. You. There you go. You get cooked. Okay. Around we go. And you. There you go. Okay, next group come in. Go and make a pie. While we cook that, put that plate there. Take that out. Get it to the next customer before they leave. There you go. Get this here. Get this here. Okay, next group is in. I gotta do some dishes now. And we'll start using that pie that I made before. Okay. Oh god, here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. For you. Okay, you guys come in. Uh, I have nowhere to put this. Put it in the dumbwaiter. Um... Crap, 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 crap. Yeah, we're gonna lose. We're gonna lose. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, uh, yeah, we're definitely gonna lose. Take it! Get out of here, get out of here, go. Oh! Wow, that was close. Um, I've got nowhere to put these things. Here, we gotta get a pie started. I've got nowhere to put this. Uh, I got nowhere to put this. Crap. The place is gonna burn. You guys just babysit that for me. Oh, it just, it disappears when it burns. Interesting. Okay, well, this is going to be it. This is going to be the end. Put it in. Oh, I have a burnt one that I need to put in. Okay, well, <laughs> this is how the first episode ends. Uh, it really lets it count down quite a bit there. Before uh, it, 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 they they give up patience and they leave. The Daily News: My restaurant is forced to close. Well, I will say, um, while I could have definitely done better, <laughs> there are things I could have done to mitigate that. Um, I I need more automation. I think that's the you know that's going to be what's going to help me. You can see I played this a little bit. I'm already a little bit in level five, and we got a safety hob there. 
I don't know if that's going to help me out too much for the next time, but that's going to do it for this first episode of my Played Up Solo. Um, I'm going to play some more, so I hope you guys are into watching it. And uh, if you guys have some tips that you think will be helpful for me, feel free to leave them down below. Uh, what are we going to cook next time? I got salad and fish, all right? So salad and fish are on the menu. I'm probably going to do some fish, but let me know what you guys want to see me cook, all right? But until then, I've been Rick, and I'll see you next time.